they were gifted that honor. Then I beg to be given the honor of leading them. You will serve where best these need. Here, at my side. My bodyguard. Hebrew allies do not even choose to fight for their camp. The Hebrews are gone! They've run! Escape! We'll fight them! Sodom, General. The Sodomite cavalry is noted for its treachery. I hope they are not vital to your plans. We hold them in reserve. With good fortune, they won't even see action. No! No! The Haramites have destroyed their camp. Gains, grain, everything will burn. All our men are in their assigned positions, what? Ready, Lot! But suppose the Helamites don't choose to fight where we want them to. That's what the decoys are for. Signal them to come towards us.
Prince's allies seem hopelessly trapped, Captain. I see the key to the trap is up there. But we turn that key. And we turn the tide of the battle. You take that tank. I'll take the other. cannot speak. We'll be massacred. Look. Order a retreat. Our men must hold them. Give us time to break the dam. The dam? No, Lord, no. No. It's our people's only hope for the future. Do you think I don't know that? What else is there to do? Nothing. We gave our word. Order our men to go on fighting till they hear the horn. The sodomites, too. When they hear the horn, they'll retreat up the side of the canyon. Come on, Evan. Back to the dam. Wait! Wait! Let's patrol 
Now move forward. Attack south face of Dan. Attack south face of Dan! Circle patrol attack north face. Good soldiers, advance! Divide! Clear the canyon! what you once called the Hebrews? My dear bodyguard, who got no opportunity to protect his sovereign? Get water and bandages for the wounded. 
from the Sodomites? We can take Sodom at a blow. Free the slaves. Give us the command, my general, and we'll burn the towers of Sodom to the dust. Well, well I'm going to accept. We have very little choice. Your Majesty, we accept your offer of food and shelter, but only until our encampment has once more been rebuilt. I will send to the wounded. some sign that I have done well in your sight, that I have made the proper choice, and show me, if you will, what it is I am to do next in thy service. Where can we get water? In there, quick. I look there. by the very water we counted on as a blessing. The water's still there. Grow things again. Not the water. This land is cursed. Not convinced. I'm not convinced at all. Neither the flood or the landslide must have carried away the earth cover. Now our soil will grow nothing. We can never raise a crop. And all this is on our land. What good is land that is poisoned, dead? Better we leave it, go back whence we came. No. No. We will accept the Queen's invitation. We will live in Sodom. Separate from them, but in their full view. Live in Sodom? No, Lot. No. This is the sign I was asking for. Jehovah has chosen me to lead my people out of the fields. We'll open up shops, give honest weights, fair measures. The sodomite tyranny is ended. Merchants who never came to Sodom before will come to buy from us. We'll pay for our land in one year. But what will we sell? Salt! And 
so it came about that the Hebrews lived within the walls of Sodom and Gomorrah. And they gave up their simple lives as farmers and herdsmen to become merchants of salt. To pay for our land, Ishmael? Or is it for you personally? No, to free the slaves. Why? Why? Oh, oh, it's the hour for Judge Locke's midday meal. Come back tomorrow and he'll do his best to listen to your grievances and dispense justice. I remember when Lot wouldn't stop work just to eat. I also, I remember he ate as he worked, said honest sweat made a crust taste as good as a meal. In those days, Lot used to say that salt should be free, like air, like water. Now we sell it for gold. Look, the tax I collect from just one day's effort. But that's to buy our land from the queen. Admit it, we sell more because our price is fair. Tell the sodomite slaves that. To meet our fair price, the sodomites work them faster, whip them harder. Lot won a great victory. Now he brings wealth to you, justice to us. Can it be that we sodomites are more generous than you Hebrews? We admire your lot. Great man. Oh, admire. We love him. And our love obliges us to remind him he is a servant of Jehovah. And that a servant must not forget his master. Your anger is intemperate, Ishmael. How else should anger be? You only explain to me what you hope to gain by such radical action. But don't you understand, Lot? It can't go on like this. We must stop them. You mean create an open breach with the Sodomites? They wouldn't even know. It would appear the slaves themselves had planned it. What is this? And when they do escape, we have the Queen's word that once inside a Hebrew dwelling, any slave has sanctuary. You would steal the Queen's property and then hide behind her word. Property? Our flesh and blood, human beings, merely property? Why, you've changed. I'm a man of peace, Ishmael. I must respect the way my neighbors think. We have accepted their hospitality, broken bread with them. What they have paid for, we cannot simply steal. If we do, we lose all moral ground for being here. Our only moral ground for being here is a free slaves. We are in Sodom to win the people over to decency. While slaves die? Of all people, you know what it's like to be a slave. Tell him. A mine slave? What do I know of mine slaves? I was never one of those. And I think their freedom is less important than our peace with Saddam. Ishmael, I order you. You will make no move without my consent. Then why do we live here? You still will not understand. As we grow in the esteem of the Sodomites, a time will come when we can attain by law all that we wish. By law! And all this you would jeopardize on one rash, destructive act. But they change us more than we change them. Their evil infects us. Look around you. Your clothes. This food. This house. We live in a nicer place because the elders wish us to. Lot's the leader of a prosperous people. And Shua, who paints a face who is never home. And my own Malab, who avoids my eyes. Is this true? Shua passes their time as others of her own age do. And as for Malab... If you gave her as much thought as you do the mind slaves, there would be no trouble between you two. How can you judge innocents who have none? If you have any charge against my wife or myself, bring it before the elders. The elders. Excuse him. He's angry with me, not you. But he doesn't realize how close, how really close we are to success without any need for force. Well, did Lot listen to you? Listen? Yes. It's what he does best these days. All he refuses to do is act. Once the queen told me that between the Hebrews and the world stood only Saddam. Do you believe in that? Yes, I do. Of all the Hebrews, who do you think is now the mightiest? My uncle, Abraham. And if you were to convert Saddam, then who would be the greatest? Lot. How proud I would be. Proud? Mm-hmm. If that should come to pass, it will be the will of Jehovah. I am simply... His chosen instrument. His instrument? No. It's for what you have done as Lot the man. 
still don't understand, do you? You still don't believe. That all the great things you accomplish are not yours at all, but thanks only to this great invisible Jehovah? No. And the times when you yourself know where the true credit lies. But, uh, your ex-slave irritates you, and now you. No. But I worry for your sake. That we should encounter hardship or danger again. Without faith, you'll be lost. Then I shall be lost. Because I can't believe in what I can't see. And I know that I will never be able to face hardship or privation ever again. But I won't have to now. Because you will protect me. Isn't it enough for now that I believe in you? Because it makes you angry. Is that why? Malib is too young, too innocent, too sweet to be as wicked as... Zion. Younger, yes. And perhaps, perhaps also sweeter. You're lying. If you had, if you did love her too, why would you bother to tell me? And why not? Hasn't it succeeded in making you jealous? You see, I was right. You are jealous. I wish I knew. I wish I knew. Come, what difference does it make? She's my sister. So then, haven't you now more in common? More in common, too, with that other Hebrew who finds our Sodom so fair, your father. My father is good. He's perfect. Did I say he wasn't? Didn't he marry one of our women? Bring your whole tribe into the city. How then do you differ from him? And how does Malib? Or I? Do I remind you of your father? Captain! Come in. Prefer the captain? He is beautiful, isn't he? Would you like to kiss him? Come on. Don't be afraid. Come on. Kiss him. Go on. 
isn't she lovely? Answer me. Try taking her in your arms. Answer me. I thought that years of devotion to your person deserved at least respect. Respect a panting dog that always wagged its tail? He goes, he thinks, to betray me. Already the Queen knows everything. I am close to death. Those tears. For you or me. For Malib. I should bring you great joy tonight, my sure. Citizens old and new. To the good word of the Hebrews that today we see reaffirmed by this final payment. From their great and illustrious leader, Lot. First against the Helamites. First in justice, I hereby appoint him advisor to myself, first minister of Sodom.
my eternal gratitude to your majesty. <laughs> to peace and goodwill. Long may it reign between our two peoples, even as her majesty reigns over us. <laughs> God's the guards. How many on duty now? Only two. The slaves are ready. best rewarded who first serves, and then asks. There was a time, Lord, when your wife could dance as they do now. An attempt has just been made by certain ex-slaves to help their friends escape. However, thanks to the loyalty of our new Hebrew citizens, they and their benefactors have been captured. Bring them forward! Bring oil. Have the fire. 
why we live. No! 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 As leader of the Hebrew people, I invoke the laws of sanctuary. But your people refuse them sanctuary. They slam the doors in their faces. Don't be killed. Refuse the sanctuary. What is this? Quiet. This man, at least, he is a Hebrew. If he has broken the law, I reserve the right to decide his punishment. Very well. To prison. To await Judge Lot's pleasure. No, no, I want to stay with them. Hold I on. want to stay with them. Let me go. Let me As go. As for the rest. Their punishment will provide us entertainment. Neither no! I nor my people will witness such a spectacle. Perhaps you'd better ask your people, Lot. I hear no protest. They seem to feel the punishment is deserved. Take them out! Stop them, Hebrews! They have more of you than them! Stop them! Stop them! Save the slaves! Save them! Save them! By all means, Lot. Save them. No! No! Save us! No! Don't let us die! Please, no! No! Help us! No! Hebrews! Help us! Hebrews! Your people grow more human, Lot. But how can you expect them to defend slaves when they know that you yourself could not defend the virtue of your own family? Your wife! Your wife, who was one of us, and will be again. She knew. But conceal it from you. Don't listen to him. He's jealous of your favor with the queen. He just wants to trap you. She shields your daughter, sure. Sure. You once vowed to kill the man who took her innocence. And I would. And kill me. See the guilt on her face. And the other, Malib, whom you find so virtuous, avenge her too. An equal struggle is more entertaining. No, lad, don't. They're only trying to provoke you.
spare me, Lord. Spare me? In the name of your God, spare me. No, Father, no. It was no one's fault but mine. Oh, let him live. Let him live. <laughs> No! How could you? How could you? You could have let him live for my sake, and you didn't. You didn't! That looks sad. I want... promise you the pleasure of my dying... in your arms. Remember... No. You won't die. I won't let you. Congratulations. How delicious to cause death. To see life leaking out of her body and to think, I did this. Why? Why? He begged you for mercy. Did he show you mercy? Or Malib? In the name of Jehovah, I punished him. In his name, you led us across the desert. You brought us through the wilderness into Sodom itself to feed your own vanity, your own pride. But he thought Jehovah had made his sword holy and that he had the right to kill an evil man. He has the right. As the first minister of Sodom, he is the law. And the Helamites? You had already defeated their army, but you let loose the waters of the dam, destroyed them, massacred them. In the name of righteousness and your God, you have abandoned yourself to the lust for blood. You are a true sodomite, Lot. Welcome. No. No. Just look at your Hebrews, Lot. Look at them. Next only to the pleasure of giving death is the excitement of watching it. They were participants in every bloody moment. You have converted the chosen people, Lot, to Sodom. I have killed. What would Hebrew justice have to say to that? Don't fall into a trap, Lot. Be careful. What would be your sentence, Judge Lot, on such a murderer? Speak up, Judge Lot. We await your word. I would sentence him to jail. Be tried for his life. <laughs> Don't let them take you away, Lot. <laughs> fight them. Please fight them. Look, your people, your people will help you. I promise you they will. <laughs> Justice is just the word. <laughs> Don't you understand, Lot? You had the right to kill him. You had the right to kill him. Oh, if you love me, I beg of you. Fight them! You don't understand. You just don't understand. Lot! 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 What's happened? Why are you here? What have they done to you? Lot! Lot! Oh, 
Lord God, Jehovah, help me. How could I have so deceived myself? How could I have done such harm when I thought only to do good? I exposed my people to temptation no man could withstand. And this I did with your name on my lips. But only pride in my heart. And now it's... It's too late. If the Queen spoke truth, if we are now as evil as she says we are, then let us destroy each other because we're not worth saving. Let us be wiped from the face of the earth. My Lord God, is there nothing of you left in us? Hear me. If there is that within us, it still struggles for life in the face of death and damnation. Let it be heard. Speak to me, Jehovah, that I may know we are worthy of survival, that we have a right to live. <laughs> We bring a message for you, Lord. The Lord's wrath is upon these places because they have corrupted even his chosen people. Because in their sinfulness, Sodom and Gomorrah would allow all God's creatures on earth to die. You must go, Lot. You must lead your people to safety. By sundown tonight, the Lord's vengeance will destroy Sodom and Gomorrah and all who live here. I give thanks to Jehovah that he finds us worthy of salvation to be his instrument on earth. But will he destroy all the Sodomites, all guilty and innocent? The innocent had their chance to speak out against the guilty and did not. But Jehovah is just. If there are 50 righteous men here, will he not spare the place for their sakes? Search then for the 50, if there are 50 righteous among the Sodomites. What, 40? Jehovah in his mercy would not destroy so many good men with the bad. Not even 30, nor 20, not even 10. If I could find ten just men among the Sodomites before sundown tonight, would he not spare the rest? Jehovah will spare the rest for ten just men. But if there are not ten, he in his vengeance will level these cities and all in them. And remember, Lot, if among those who leave there are any who look back, Jehovah will know they do so in regret for the ways of Sodom, and he will smite them. Let no one look back. No one. I thank thee, Jehovah, for thy mercy. Let you abdicate, Lord. You're still our leader, Lord. Command us. A miracle. I was freed. See? My chains dropped off. I was freed. Lot, too. He has seen the miracle. Look at his face. Enough talk of miracles. We want our leader back. Lord. Do not desert us. 
I sinned. And then in my pride, I thought to punish myself. But now I know there is another who will punish me in his own time. We must leave these cities. Are we not to stay? No. To win the Sodomites over? Hold. In the name of the Queen. Let us pass. Don't be a fool. I have my orders. But he'll kill you. In the name of Jehovah. Come up for your sky. It's another miracle. No. Come, we must tell our people. We must tell them what we have seen. Stop it. Stop the wheel. Stop the wheel. They're dead. The entertainment has ended. Has it just begun? Friends, Hebrews, these cities are accursed. We must all leave here before the sun goes down. <laughs> Captain, take this man. No, help him up. Let him talk. He amuses us. These cities will be smitten from the earth, reduced to dust. Hebrews, listen to me. I have been proud. I led you here to be corrupted by an evil people. <laughs> but the Lord in his mercy offers us salvation. Come, follow me. Leave this monstrous place! A miracle, of course. Yes, you must believe. Look at the sun. It is already low. Each moment it sinks lower. We have only till it sets. Why not then? He is mad. Crazed. He can do us no harm. And you citizens of Sodom, of Gomorrah, if there are ten among you who will come with us, but ten hear you, then the Lord Jehovah will spare your cities and all who live here. <laughs> Only ten. Ten who still believe in life and not death. Don't laugh. Follow me, I Just beg you. Lot. I Angel of vengeance. And now a messenger of Jehovah himself. Be happy that he's free. A man like Lot moves in strange ways. Who knows what he really thinks or what he plans to do? You, come, before it's too late. Leave me alone. Can't you see I'm happy here? <laughs> the Lord offers you one last chance to redeem yourself. Forgo your perverse pleasures. Come, Lot. You have killed the Helamites, Lot. Rid me of my brother. And now you wish to leave? Leave Sodom even richer in salt than when you came. By all means, go. And if ten of my people wish to go with you, they may do so. Think of all your people. Lead them with us. What you call sin, to me is virtue. And all powerful death whom you hate, I worship. I turn my back on you, Lot. On you and your impotent God. <laughs> Cloud, lightning. Such simple wonders you teach your people to fear. It is not from fear that they leave Sodom, but from faith. Faith in him whose passing shadow may be a cloud, whose voice is a thunder. Look long on that sun. You 
You'll never see it again. Follow me. Hebrews, have faith. Pray. Listen to the elders. Listen. A hot wind from the desert will have a storm. It will be beautiful. Follow me. Lot, is it true Sodom will be destroyed? I was told, as I told you, that's a sight I've been long to see. Come, follow your elders. Goodbye, Lot. Goodbye. People are waiting. We must join them quickly. Mallet. Mallet. Sure. I know I have a lot to answer for. I'll try my best to do so. Only now, please obey me. Go with your sister. I'll go. Because I prayed Jehovah to hear you cry out, as I cried, to see you struck to earth, to crawl on your hands and knees. Until I see that happen, I won't leave you ever. Father. I did not free myself. Jehovah freed me. Only he can conquer Sodom and Gomorrah. Come. Only to make you see, make everyone see, that it is Lot who is strong, Lot who is courage. Come. I was told, so now I tell you. Once we leave these cities, if there are those among us who look back, only so much as look back, mind you, then Jehovah will know that we do so in regret for the ways of Sodom, and he will smite us. Let no one look back. No one. Pass the word among you. Lord, 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 Lord. Stay back! Stay back! Stay back! The gate! Close the gate! Help! Stay back! Stay back! Help! You are all free men now. Come, join the others. A miracle. Why, by an unseen Jehovah has not forsaken. It's another miracle. It's the hand of Jehovah. Jehovah has opened the gates. The miracle? No. It was the wind. The wind that blew them open. Don't look back! Don't look back! Keep going!
Eldith, what is it? I don't believe. You must. I can't. Yes, you must. I tried, but I just Please can't. Please believe. Just the summer storm. I must go. Nothing to worry about. them already.
It is Lud's name that should be on their lips. He is responsible for everything good that has happened. There is no such thing as Jehovah. Thank <laughs> you. 